Hey everybody, long time no see. Um, been really busy, we've been really low on money, so there's not a lot we can do to our van yet. Or customers, they've been low on money because summertime hits and you know, you want to get a pool and you get all that good stuff, whatever. I understand, we got a pool ourselves. But I've just been working out my spare time, um, getting more videos lined up for you guys, but um, today we are working on a 2005 Honda Odyssey. The tie rod in needs replaced, and here's the tie rod in. This is an outer tie rod in. I'm going to show you how to replace the outer tie rod in on the 2005 Honda Odyssey step by step so you can see what needs done. Basically, I'm going to show you how to do it without having to go get an alignment directly afterwards because most of the time when you do it the, the wheel will be out too far or in too far I've kind of I kind of have a way with a paint pen that just it's it's really easy way I'll show you but stay tuned I'll show you step by step what to do first thing you're gonna do is loosen the lug nuts while the vehicles on the ground it helps a lot don't take them off slide the jack in jack it up then take them off make sure you use a jack stand we'll get started with that now Here's the outer tie rod in. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make a mark here with a paint pen first. With this nut, you're going to want to make a mark on that. Then what we're going to do is we're going to bend this cotter pin straight and then pull it out. And afterwards we will hammer on this spot right here. Not on this, but on that. That will jar it loose and it will pop up out of there. So let's get started doing that. Okay, I don't know if you've seen what I did, but sometimes the best way to get these nuts loose is to tighten them first. So I tighten it a little bit and then it jolt, both breaks right loose. Next, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hammer here. Make sure you have a really good sledge. Carefully spin this, but only the shaft. Now, the new one came with a brand new cotter pin, a brand new castle nut. What you'll do is you will tighten this up until it reaches that nut, no tighter than that. Because you want to keep the same alignment you just had. And that's it. That's all it is to replace an outer tie rod in on a 2005 Honda Odyssey. That's it, guys. Like, subscribe, share. If you're already a subscriber, share my videos. I'm sorry for not having more videos, but I will as soon as possible. Um, I might start up another YouTube channel. I'm aiming that one mostly on like fitness and just funny videos and stuff like that. But this one, I'm trying to keep it strictly cars when possible. So. Subscribe and share everybody. Thanks for watching.